Monday. Today I have a ton of things on my list of things I need to get done. So last week I felt really sick all week. I had like this rash which I thought was from something I ate because every time I would eat I would get hot and like flushed and itchy and just dry it was really it was really weird i'm finally feeling better so that started exactly a week ago and then i also had my family in town thursday through sunday which was yesterday this thursday through sunday i'm flying to indianapolis to see a friend so today through wednesday i have a lot of things i want to get done just a few things on the to-do list for the next couple of days is get our house in order it's just a mess you know when you have visitors and you're it's like I'll get around to those things later just like the rooms they slept in and we have a ton of dishes just need to sort the house out a little bit but that's for later I also need to finish editing a YouTube video and make the thumbnail and that's all about my video about wintering kind of feeling down and like little meh I also need to do some work on my website which is a little bit overwhelming just because I haven't done that much with my website so whenever I do go and do things it just takes me a bit longer to figure out what exactly I'm doing. I've been looking into Notion because I've heard a lot of people talk about Notion and Google Calendar for planning their life so I kind of want to watch some videos on that. I also want to read I am right on track with my 50 book year goal. I think I read 12 and for it being March 7th, that is not too bad. I also want to spend time with Kyle because before my family was here, he was gone on a work trip for a few days. So I just feel like I haven't spent as much time with him. And I also opened up an Etsy shop yesterday. I only have one thing in it. It's a luggage tag that I designed. My mom's a flight attendant, so she just wanted something fun and she thought some of her flight attendant friends would like it too. I want to keep creating things and adding things to the store because yeah, right now I just have the one thing that's super exciting. So I'd like to just spend some time drawing. So those are a lot of the things I would like to get done. There are some other things that if they happen would be great to get done as well. But for now, I'm going to focus on those things and I'm going to go get some work done. I can't even sit in my office because it is an absolute mess. So I definitely need to clean that later. I'm gonna go finish editing the YouTube video, make the thumbnail for that. walk run. I just started a couch to 5k training plan. I used to run a lot. I ran a marathon. I could easily run an hour without stopping, but that was many years ago. So I'm easing back into it really slowly so I don't have any injuries because it's been a long time since I have ran, but I really enjoy running. So I want to get back into it. And Kyle and I, when we first started dating, used to go on runs together. So we're easing back into it. He could probably go much faster and just jump into a run and be just fine. But I tend to get injured if I go too fast. So I'm going nice and slow. Kyle joined me today. We were going to go to workout class at four and I had totally forgotten that we had made plans for someone to come over and meet the dogs. She's going to take care of them when we're gone in April. So thankfully I remembered at 3.30 right before we were supposed to leave for the workout class because she came over right after that. So yeah, it went really well. She seems great, the dogs like her, so I feel much better about leaving them in her care. I sat at the desk from this morning when you saw me at like 8 a.m. all the way until three when I started frantically cleaning because this person was going to come over. Not that our house was that messy, but with my family just being here this weekend, there was a bunch of stuff around, so I just cleaned up a little bit, so the house was presentable. I spent the morning editing my last YouTube video, finished uploading it, did the thumbnail, but it always takes me way longer than I think it's going to. And then while I was eating lunch, I watched someone's video on how they set up their Notion. So I thought that was super interesting. I want to watch a few more just to see um, kind of what people do with Notion. But so far I really like it and I think it has everything I want in one place. So I think I'll be transferring all of my productivity and lists and things into Notion. I just need to figure out the best setup for me. And then during the afternoon, I spent time working on my website. So I've had a website for almost two years now and I just got a new template or a theme. So I've been learning how to adjust things and change everything from the last format of the website I was using. So it just takes me a long time. I know once I have it down, it'll go by really quickly, but. This afternoon took a while for me to just figure out some things, so it was pretty draining. I was ready to be done with it, but I do need to keep working on my website because it's not finished yet. But for now, I'm gonna go get cleaned up and start making dinner. We got a HelloFresh order this week. We don't do that all the time, but every once in a while, especially if I see something on the menu that I really want, 
And this week they had the beef bulgogi meatballs, which are my absolute favorite recipe. I've made them in a YouTube video already and they just make me so happy. So I'm gonna go clean up and then get making that. <music> Cooking with Kyle. <laughs> Not even cooking. You're cleaning. It's cleaning with Kyle. Cleaning with Kyle. You're right. Cleaning with Kyle. Take two. Cleaning with Kyle. I almost messed it up. <laughs> Lots of butter ice cream. Peanut butter ice cream. And we put peanut butter in it. And then a huge marshmallow swirl. Mm. I can't convey to you. Mom was here this weekend. We put together the rest of our entryway. Love it. Looks pretty good. Just imagine the Manchester City flag above all of those knickknacks. No one wants that. I do. <laughs> I'm someone. It would detract from the aesthetically pleasing of the no, greens and the browns. It would provide and the something pain. that we could switch throughout the season. Manchester City. Where would you Barcelona, even go? Barcelona. Vikings. Giants. Sixers, it'd be great! No. Sports ball! Good morning, it's 11 a.m. on Tuesday. I woke up this morning, went to a yoga class, came home, had my morning routine, shower, day breakfast, all the things. And I just finished editing my podcast episode to go on YouTube. So I'm in the process of making all my podcast episodes videos just so they have another home. So I did that and now I need to upload it. But I made a list of everything I need to get done today. It's a lot of things. 
So right now I have laundry going. Our bedding was very dirty because the dogs sleep in bed with us when they want to. And I showed you the backyard yesterday. You saw how muddy it was. So the mud kind of comes into our sheets here and there. Not a ton. Our sheets are like filthy, but they're just a little muddy. So time to wash those. So laundry's going. I have some other laundry I need to get done today. I'd also really like to spend some time organizing my Notion, setting that up. I think that will take a while, but I know it's one of those things that was a lot of work at the beginning and then eventually will just save me lots and lots of time. Also on my to-do list, I have journal because I haven't done that yet for the day. I have errands I need to run. I need to go to Target. I need to go to the library, pick up a library book, make a return. And then I'd also like to run to just the dollar store and pick up some things for the book I'm writing. I just want a better way of organizing it. So I'm thinking like a big board and then probably like little sticky notes just so I can keep my ideas of what I'm doing all in like one place. I haven't, I haven't figured it out yet, but something like that. And then some emails I need to respond to and then also make some Instagram posts for Instagram and schedule those Instagram posts. So it's a lot of things and it's already 11. So I'm going to get to work on uploading my podcast episode to YouTube first and then kind of just see what I'm in the mood for after that and probably run the errands right after lunch. Notion pack which will help me set up my own Notion everything. Her name is Michelle B on YouTube so I just got her life map Notion pack. It looks like it's gonna take a lot of time to go through but it looks really fun. So first I'm gonna go run my errands and then I'll come back make myself some tea settle down and then just dive into this Notion setup. <laughs> got back from running errands, got my tea, and now I'm going to dive in and learn about this Notion pack and set up Notion for myself. So I'm super excited and yeah, hopefully it doesn't take me forever. Actually, if you would like to go just pour in a dash of creamer, Actually, <laughs> okay. What a blessing, and a spoon, please. Okay. You ever just drink the creamer? No, I bet I'd like it. I just tried it. Is it good? It's really good. <laughs> it's like an ice cream sundae. You don't need much. Wow. Isn't that amazing? And I put so much of that in my coffee. Mm -hmm. It doesn't taste like melted ice cream. A it melted is. waffle cone ice cream. Yeah. It's amazing. All right, going back to watching my video. You can stay in here, but Nobody I got lots of things to do. Oh, my goodness. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want that mouth. This is a lot more work than I thought it was going to be.
morning. I just made my second cup of coffee this morning. Not sure if it's entirely necessary, but I just wanted more, so I made some more. Last night, I ended up subbing a last minute yoga class, so I did that for the evening. This morning, I did my morning routine things and I met with my weekly dream team partner. We're just like accountability partners. So once a week, we FaceTime for like half an hour and talk about what we accomplished this past week, what we are going to, what we would like to accomplish the next week, just for our big long-term goals, um, and then prayer requests. So she lives a couple hours away from me, so we FaceTime once a week. We've been doing this for almost two years. Today was our 61st meeting. I think we don't meet every, every single week, but we try to meet every single week unless one of us has something going on. The meetings have been super great, and the only reason I get anything done is because I know I have an accountability partner who is pushing me towards getting the things done that I say I'm going to get done. Otherwise, I probably just wouldn't do a lot of things. Tomorrow morning, I'm leaving to go out of town for a few days to visit a friend. So I have lots of things to do on my to-do list today. First things first is I want to do my 500 words, my creative writing that I work on every single day. But today, instead of doing actual 500 words, I got my... Um, giant pieces of take board yesterday at the Dollar Tree and some sticky notes. So today I just want to kind of outline things. That's what I'm going to do for that time this morning. I also still need to do my art for 30 minutes. So I'm going to get that done. And then I wrote down a bunch of other things on my to-do list that I need to get done, like taking care of my plants, responding to some people. I need to do some meal prep and keep organizing Notion. I spent a couple hours doing that yesterday and it is going to be life-changing. I can't believe I didn't do it before, but I'm super pumped about it. So I just wanna spend some more time working on that. And I'm also gonna go work out in a couple hours. First things first, I'm gonna do my writing and my art and then I'll probably go work out and then come back and kind of get everything else done on my to-do list for the day. So that's the plan as of right now. Hopefully I can get all those things done so I can feel nice and ready to be gone for a couple days. Oh, 